The family of a nine-year-old chess prodigy is fighting to stay in Britain so he so that he may become the country's first world champion. Indian Montreal's Royal has lived in the UK since he was three but may be sent back to India when his father's work visa expires in September. Vion's Mandy Clark has the story. Shira's Royal is considered the best chess prospect of his generation. He's only played chess for four years, but is already beating teenagers a decade older than him. I played in 200, uh, I think, approximately 200 chess championships, and approximately three quarters of them I've won. He says on weekdays he can only play for three hours, but on weekends he spends six to seven hours on the game. Uh, people at school know me very well for chess, and they find me in newspapers and magazines. So, yeah. His father's visa expires in September, but says they will fight to stay for the sake of his son's chess career. He is the national asset of uh, England, and he already re represented England in three international tournaments, like in Romania, Brazil, in World Cadet, European Youth in Romania, European School in Greece. And he already proved there. He got the medals for England, and that will be a big achievement after 17 years. Junior category, someone got the medal for England. So, on the basis of this, because he's already a national asset and exceptional talent, so on that basis, we are going to apply with the Home Office. Royal is coached by the renowned chess trainer Julian Simple. He's going to be another one, as I call it. He's going to be another GM, another grandmaster. He has to become an IM first, an international master. Well, he's already a candidate master at six. Royal has been named the world's youngest candidate master. He says the game felt natural to him. He has the trophies and medals to prove it. Well, he's already a national asset, but he could be even more of, of that, more of a national asset. To, to see him go would be, oh, I might even weep. <laughs> You'd see a grown man cry. It's now up to the British Home Office to decide whether Royal will be allowed to stay thanks to his extraordinary chess talent. Mandy Clark, we on London.